perfect though. So I have a meet, Zoom meeting with a lady I'm doing a collaborate. Should I look at the screen or the camera? With a lady I'm doing a collaboration with. And um, what time is it? It's at 12 and it's 11.24 right now. I just get really anxious about being late. So I'm always too early. I'm sorry I keep looking back and forth. I'm just getting used to this new camera. But um, yeah, I tried this revolution super dewy um skin tint i'm not liking it i think it's i think it's because like i didn't put any primer on or something but it's like i don't know if you can see it but i have like spots it's just not i don't know it's not all that and i'm gonna probably sit here and wait until it's 12 o'clock I look, I look like I have a lazy eye because I keep looking back and forth. I'm sorry, guys. It is 11.50 and I have, this is like the first thing I'm eating today. So I have 10 minutes to eat my breakfast. Here comes Benji. This is so awkward just like waiting. Wait, how do I join a meeting? I always forget about, forget how to do this. Um, I have three other tattoos. Yeah, so yeah, you know how this works. So for us, it's a little bit different. Um, so we ask if you to do design survey beforehand, just so our artists are prepared. Uh, we also uh, kind of like all the artists are paid on salary. So that contributes to the cost of that tattoo. You don't have to tip if you don't want to. Happy to do it if you, if you want to if you're an artist, but they are paid for their time, not how many tattoos they do in a day. Okay. Um, yeah, and then when you get to the studio, they'll also tell you a little bit more about the fading process. And like they will show you pictures of how it fades month to month. But generally, um, what makes us different from permanent tattoos is that our ink particles are smaller than permanent ink tattoos, so over time, the body will absorb the ink, and eventually it will fade over time, usually between 9 to 15 months. Everyone's fade journey is a little bit different and unique, depending on your skin, but 9 to 15 months is the range that we currently have. Hey, so, um, I'm like really tired right now. This is what happens when you um, don't sleep, well, you go to sleep late, and you wake up by like 10 a.m., but... Hey guys. Oh, I look tired. So I got some, I feel like I got a lot of stuff, but it's just three things from Sephora. And it's, um, they're travel size, but they're still expensive. So don't be fooled. So I got a Charlotte Tilbury matte lipstick in Cover Star. I'm trying to get like my makeup look down pack before, down packed before my birthday so I'm just like getting new products and I got the OS translucent setting powder I'm getting small things because I'm tired of getting like full size products and hating the product and it's just going to waste and I got the milk um, bronzer stick and baked they don't have they only have travel sized bronzing sticks I think yeah. Let me close this dough. So y'all, I haven't straightened my hair for a while and I'm really proud of myself. I'm trying not to straighten my hair until early December because my birthday is the 4th. So I'm gonna go all of November without straightening my hair. And honestly, I think I can do it because I think I look better with curly hair. And um, honestly, the only reason, the only, um, what am I trying to say? Straightening your hair is only fun when you don't do it a lot. Because like, I don't know. I feel like I only do it for the convenience. Okay, so first up, I'm going to try the Milk Bronzer. Um, let me zoom in a little bit. 
and um honestly i think i need to be doing my bronzer before i do my concealer so that's what i'm gonna do oh my gosh really did y'all really have to add a top all right let's let's see what she's talking about Oh, it's really smooth. It's really smooth. Hmm. Alrighty, let's see how she blends. It's not as pigmented as I thought it would be. Like, it doesn't make that big of a difference. I'm so bad at doing contour. Benji's in the background licking his toy. Let's see if the beauty blender makes a difference. No, makes it worse. All right, I did my concealer. I'm really disappointed on the bronzer, but I'm going to try this SO, I think that's how you say it, SO translucent powder. I got to take the top off first. I've only heard good things about this, but I'm not going to take your word for it. I got to try, try it out on my own. So let's see what we working with. Oh, by the way, there's no way in hell I'm ever putting powder on my forehead. If you have textured skin, you would know. But yeah, there's no way. Should I leave it? Get off my, get off. Get off. Benji. Look at him. Get off, Benjamin. There's no reason you should be on my bed stand. Benjamin. Moment of truth. Oh, all right, y'all might have been right. Y'all might have been right. Okay. <sighs> yeah. It's so smooth looking. And now I'm gonna try the um, lipstick. Now keep in mind, lipstick always looks better when you're when you have like a full face of makeup, like your eyeshadow and everything. That is a really pretty bottle. But I'm gonna use the Charlotte Tilbury liner in Iconic Nude. I use this shit with everything. I'm gonna try to like bring it, I'm gonna put a lot on so I'm gonna put the lipstick in the middle of my lips. All right, you can see I left a little bit of lightness in the middle of my lips so I can go in with the lipstick. This looks different from the style. Okay. Hold on. Why does lip why does lipstick never look good on me? Yeah, no. Absolutely not. I might be the lip liner, but this is actually the look I was going for. I just I'm just not doing it right, I think. Maybe it needs some gloss. 
It's I really like the smell of lips lipstick. It actually looks really cute. Yeah. How do I start this like conversation? So I have like this new dating mindset or when it comes to like a relationship, it's just to detach yourself, not like in a bad way, but just like you shouldn't care about things you don't have any control over. Like if God or whoever you believe in didn't put it in my face and like say this is what's happening, I'm not going to go out my way to like find out stuff I'm not supposed to know. And you would say that that's like I'm trying to be delusional, but ignorance is bliss. I don't want this to get lost in translation and you guys take this as, oh, I just let my man do whatever he wants and I just wait at home. No, I'm saying like, I'm my own person. I don't have time to babysit. I'm not going to be an FBI. I'm not going to do any of that if I'm in a relationship. I want to be able to just sit and relax. And that's what I've been doing. And it's like so peaceful. It's amazing. Everything, everything that's done in the dark eventually comes to light. But I'm not about to go looking in the dark for something. Okay? I'm going to stay in the light. I'm going to stay peaceful because, yeah. You should not care about things you have no control over. So if you have to be an FBI, if you have to be a babysitter, then that person is not meant for you. I promise you. I got some PR. I'm, stop. So I don't know how to say this. Say, say, but they sent me some makeup. Um, ooh, liquid cheek blush. Let's see how this looks. Pretty. Hold on. I thought it was lipstick. I was just looking for some liquid brush too. And lip blur. It's matte lipstick in the color Dada. Let's see. Pretty. I'm gonna try all this on, on TikTok. And more lipstick in the shade Modern. Let's see how this looks. I really was like trying to um, develop like a cute matte lipstick combo and hopefully this will look good. These are kind of similar. This one's more neutral. This is, this is Dada. Wait. I don't know. Mascara. Why isn't it focusing? I love the smell of mascara. Mm. And what is in this bag? It, cotton balls. These are cotton balls. Use them. They're cotton balls. So I guess to... Hold on. Oh, so the packaging is padded with cotton balls. So I guess I can use them too. So... That's pretty resourceful, resourceful. Oh, 
This package is from Myro. I remember that. Okay, so this is the bottles everything is supposed to go in. This is the um, deodorant refill pod. I got it in the scent Cucumber and Jasmine Spearmint. And this is the body wash concentrate. It's in the same scent. And this is the body wash bottle. It's pretty cool. I think... Oh, you push it. That's how you do it. I'm bored, so I'm gonna try on the shade in Modern. I don't do this when you're on the phone cupcaking with your friends. Cupcake, cupcake. Yeah. Okay, boo, be bored then. Who said I'm bored? When did I say that? When? No, I didn't. Uh uh. What's today? I'm not even telling you. You can go to hell. Get your ass back now. I'm gonna delete all this shit. Delete all this shit. Exactly. 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 Look at your stuff. Like, drop it. Drop it. Drop it. I'm hot. Drop it. Look at you out of breath. and clean all right pose this this goofy big goofy right here you be goofy don't be disrespecting me like that Fuck. don't be disrespecting me like that that's that's why the lighting looks bad and bitch you looking sad in the background i need to take it right here Stand right here. Oh, I want to get the bag. I want to get the crib. Shit, man. Shit, man. Shine that flash on. Then why couldn't I stand right here in the first place? Yeah, come on. <sighs> I'm dating a diva. Benji, I'm laughing at Benji. You just want the flash? Yeah. All right, let me see. Look how good I look though. Like I'm the star. Do you like him? 
Look at Benji. He knows we leaving. Oh, are you are you sad? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Pookie. <laughs> he looks so sad. This is the fit. You now some swipe. This doesn't match. No, it's not that serious. I just don't like how you say, lie and say it matches just so I can get that out the house faster. It matches. But when it matches, it's more clear. It's more clear. That don't fit. So Hey guys, so um, I'm gonna just give my little review on Cirque du Soleil. So um, obviously I can't record in there, but um, this is my third time going. And the last time I went, it was a couple years ago, but I remember the two times I went, it was amazing. Like it was literally captivating. The tricks they did were insane. The the acrobats were crazy. I remember this guy spinning. They were on roller skates and they're like spinning each other on each other's necks. It was crazy. Like each act was crazy and insane. But the one I just went to, I think the theme was curiosity. And I don't know, guys. It was just not, I was, exp I had such high hopes because of the last two times I went, so I didn't even bother checking the theme, and um, I don't know, it was kind of boring. It was really creative, everybody was really talented, but it was like, from what I was expecting, it was kind of a letdown, and it's because I think the theme was more cinematic, like it was more of a play, like if you like plays, you would have liked that. It was, yeah. If you are expecting something crazy and captivating, like I was explaining before, then you shouldn't, I don't think you should go. But if you like sitting there and paying attention to the costumes, to the storyline, then I think you would like it. But that wasn't what I went there for. Let me take my be real picture for the day. I'm always like six hours late. I'm gonna put y'all in it. Posted. Look at Chase. Who the fuck get happy about a seafood ball? Sofa sale going on now. Huh? Every sofa is on sale. 
It's kind of cold, isn't it? It's a dog now. We go all out with the lights. Food? We live for food. I love Mama's dumplings. We go through boxes. We're cold. Hot. Yeah, yeah. That shit hard at four. Hey, Max. That's cute.